Yellowstone Volcano. How huge earthquake broke seismometer too much shaking. Yellowstone Volcano scientists were put on high alert when an earthquake broke nearby seismographs. A USGS scientist revealed. The Yellowstone Volcano sits in between the US states of Wyoming, Montana and Idaho, inside the Yellowstone National Park. The caldera is labeled a supervolcano due to its capability to inflict disaster on a global scale should another super eruption occur. The last event of this kind has not occurred for more than 630,000 years and any serious eruption in 70,000 which apparently makes it overdue. However, United States Geological Survey, USGS, Scientists were put on high alert in 2002 when the Denali earthquake occurred in Alaska. This 7.9 magnitude event was the largest recorded in the US in 37 years. A scientist revealed, Jacob Lowenstein, who is in charge of monitoring Yellowstone for USGS, revealed a diagram during a lecture at Menlo Park, California, that showed the shockwaves produced. He said in 2014, the Denali earthquake occurred in 2002 and it was a magnitude 7.9 that occurred on the Denali fault up in Alaska. Anytime you have an earthquake, especially on a strike slip fault, you'll get surface waves produced. Those are the ones that do a lot of damage to buildings. And in the case of this particular earthquake, it sent big surface waves out in a southeasterly direction. Now even one of these little diamonds here represent a seismic station. Dr. Lowenstein went on to explain how seismometers near Yellowstone failed to record the impact. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.